testing is a vital element to making sure that you know what's going on inside your reef tank. And today we're gonna to be talking about which test kits I use and um, why I use them. What's up guys, welcome back to Real Reefing TV. I'm Cody Grates, helping you save time, money, and frustration in the real reefing hobby, sharing my experiences and knowledge. And if you're new to this channel, consider subscribing and that way you can be up to date with any of the new content that's coming out. I try to get content out about weekly. Sometimes I skip a week, sometimes I don't. Just, you know, life gets in the way, but I like to keep the content rolling for you guys. So today we're talking about which test kits I use to make sure that I know what's going on inside this reef tank. Now, I've done some, I've gone back and forth um, between, you know, like titration tests and and colorometers, photometers, or whatever you want to call them. So let me tell you what I have in here. I've got phosphate Hanna checker. It's not the ultra low, so it tells me in part per million, not part per trillion. I have the alkalinity Hanna checker. Um, I've got the calcium Hanna checker in here as well, right here. And I've got it's just a kit, right? So like, um, I have the reagents here for the Red Sea Calcium. And then I have, like I told you guys before, the Red Sea Magnesium and Red Sea Marine Care Test Kit, right? So which one of these do I actually use? I use the Red Sea here for nitrate, I don't really test nitrite. I feel like that's that's a waste of time unless you have issues in your tank. I also use it to test ammonia. Again, issues in tank or new tank, you're, that's really the only time you're gonna use that. Well, that's about it. Um, pH, I really don't need to know that I have pH probes on my tank, so why would I need to know that? And then I use magnesium. I only use this every now and then uh, to figure out, well, uh, magnesium. Pretty easy when it comes to Red Sea and the titration on the magnesium test kits. I definitely love the Hanna checker for alkalinity. It's great, it's easy. You just take a sample of water, you zero it, you put the reagent in, and you click the button and you get your reading. Super fast, super easy, love that. The phosphate checker, it takes a little bit of time. And, and if you miss the timing on it, you know, but I use it because it's accurate and I can definitely, I can trust it. Um, the calcium Hanna checker, if anybody's looking to buy one, I'll sell you this one. We don't use it um, because it just takes a lot of time and steps and multiple different, like you have to have RO water, you have to have tank water, you have two different reagents to use. There's just too many steps in it and it's just not for me. What I do use to test calcium is the Red Sea reagent, um, the Red Sea titration test. Super easy, super fast, love it, it's easy. I got it. it's great. Those are the things that I'm using it for testing on my tank. Now, something that's new and that was sent to me um, that I've had a little bit of chance to kind of play around with, and I've seen it at shows before, and it's this uh, exact a dip exact I dip I don't, you know, Okay, however you say it, this is it. You guys have probably have seen this. One of the, some of the unique features about this is that it connects directly to your phone and the, the readout of the actual test results go directly to your phone and they're stored there. So that's really cool and pretty valuable. The next thing is it's pretty easy to use. I did a phosphate test kit with it. Okay, so it was basically just the waiting time that I had to wait for the photometer inside of the actual tester to be able to read the sample. But as far as effort from me and time that I had to spend actually doing the test, it was very, very minimal compared to a titration test kit or a HANA checker test kit. So I really like that about it. So if you wanna know where to be able to find any of these test kits, I'm gonna drop links in the description below so that you can find these. Um, I definitely recommend the ones that I use. What I do recommend for phosphate is the HANA checker. I recommend the HANA checker for alkalinity and for calcium, magnesium, I recommend Red Sea and also for nitrate and ammonia and all that, you're, you're gonna wanna pick up this Marine Care test kit. So like I said, I'll drop all those in the links below um, in the description. 
as well as this new exact eye dip down in the description below if you guys want to check out more about it there will be a video coming out very soon on you know what's included here how does it compare price wise if i you know was to go buy all the other test kits that would be included in this thing like is it actually worth it so i'll be doing a video on that very soon you guys will be able to check that out in the meantime though go check out one of my other videos right over here and you can hit that subscribe button if you haven't already done it i don't know why you're taking your time with that just all right guys i'm out on this one later